Hello, type to us here. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to save an Illustrator file as a PDF. So without further ado, let's get right into it. So as you can see, I have opened this Illustrator document with this design right here. And let's say that we want to export this as a PDF. We can actually do that in a few easy steps. So when we are ready to export our design, we want to go up to the top bar and choose File right here. And then go down where it says Save As. You can also use the keyboard shortcut Shift Control S. From here, we want to find a folder on our computer where we would like to save our PDF. I've just found a folder right here, and let's just call this Sky Background. So yeah, just give it a name. Then if we go down right here, we have the file type. And you can see that this is right now set to Adobe Illustrator. And we want to export a PDF, so we want to click right here and choose the second option, which is Adobe PDF. When that's selected, you want to go down right here and choose Save. And you can see that this Save Adobe PDF panel will now show up. And in here we have all of our settings for our PDF. So first off, we have our Adobe PDF preset. So we can just set this to whatever we would like. We can choose high quality print if we would like to get a high quality PDF but we can also choose some of the other options. I'll just go with the Illustrator default. And if you go over to the right side right here, you can see that we have all of these different options you can choose from. The first one right here is the compression. And that is if you have any images you would like to compress in your PDF, you can do it in here. We also have the marks and bleeds. So let's say that we want to add trim marks or registration marks to your PDF, you can just check these boxes and it will add it on the PDF. And the same if you want a bleed. Then we have the output, so we can choose the color profile. So if we choose convert to destination, we can choose a color profile. This is right now just set to document RGB and that is just fine. We also have the advanced and security and summary options. I typically don't use these, but you can check it out if you would like to do that. When you have changed your settings for your PDF, we are now actually ready to save it. And you can do that if you go down right here and just press save PDF. And it will just load a bit. And because I have Adobe Acrobat installed, it will automatically open as a PDF right here. If you don't have that, you can just go to the folder on your computer where you have saved your PDF. And as you can see, the PDF is right here. And if I just double click on it, it will open. So yeah, that is actually how to save an Illustrator file as a PDF in Adobe Illustrator. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you found this video helpful. Don't forget to subscribe and like the video. Never so for now, see you in the next one.